Once upon a time, in a cozy little house on the edge of a quiet forest, lived a young girl named Lily. Lily was known for her love of adventure and her faithful companion, a teddy bear named Spotty. Spotty had patches all over, giving him his unique name. One chilly October evening, as the full moon peeked through the trees, Lily decided it was time for a spooky adventure. She whispered to Spotty, Tonight, we're going to explore the haunted woods. Spotty, with his stitched on smile, looked a bit nervous, but he trusted Lily with all his fluff. Together, they ventured into the dark forest. The leaves rustled underfoot, and the wind whispered eerie tales. As they walked deeper into the woods, strange sounds echoed around them. Lily's heart raced, but she held Spotty tight. They came across a twisted tree with gnarled branches that seemed to reach out for them. Look, Spotty, Lily said, it's the wicked witch tree. Just then, a gust of wind made the tree's branches sway, and it cast spooky shadows that danced around them. Spotty shivered, but Lily reassured him, don't worry, Spotty, it's just the wind playing tricks on us. They continued their journey and stumbled upon an old, abandoned cabin. This must be the witch's cottage, whispered Lily. The windows were dark, but a faint, eerie glow seeped from under the door. Spotty felt his stuffing tremble, but Lily said, Let's take a peek, Spotty, but be very quiet. They opened the creaky door and found themselves inside a room filled with shelves of mysterious potions and jars of colorful, glowing liquids. At the center of the room stood a cauldron that bubbled and hissed. This is where the witch brews her potions, said Lily in awe. Just then, a black cat with bright, green eyes appeared and purred. Oh, it's just a friendly kitty, exclaimed Lily petting it. Spotty relaxed a little and gave the cat a nod of approval. They left the witch's cottage and continued deeper into the woods, but as the moon reached its highest point in the sky, they heard a ghostly moan. Spotty clung to Lily, his patches trembling. What was that? he asked. Lily, fearless as ever, smiled and said, that, Spotty, was just the friendly ghost of the haunted woods, saying hello. It's time for us to go back home. With Spotty still in her arms, Lily retraced their steps, leaving the spooky forest behind. As they reached their cozy little house, Lily tucked Spotty into bed and kissed him goodnight. Thanks for being so brave, Spotty, she said. Now, let's sleep tight, and tomorrow, We'll have another adventure. And so, in the warm glow of their nightlight, Spotty closed his eyes, knowing that with Lily by his side, even the spookiest of adventures could become the most magical bedtime stories.